as far as I'm concerned. That's no, awesome. As far as I'm concerned. Whoa, I just heard, inside hey! the OMG. I just heard two brand new Episode. names. I think two names. Episode number 33. I don't even know. This episode is older than you. We, ah, Yes, yeah. 33. <laughs> okay, that's one way to out it. Episode 33. It <laughs> and we've got a special guest with us tonight. My brother, Bronco, is here. Hey, everybody. There's a ton of Hodzics in the so, room. So, yeah, yeah, this is, we're outnumbering you at the moment. Yeah, I feel that, <laughs> trust me, I feel that way. And well, who, okay knows, who knows, you might get some good dirt, though. Uh, I definitely, I definitely got it. Yeah. People didn't hear it. I think we wasted it off mic, but I, I got good behind the scenes on the song you just heard on the intro. We can, we can yeah. talk about it a little bit. Which because we, we talked about in the past. We have. I just, we have. I but, needed to know how it got there. Right. That's what I needed to know. So, Box Spring. Which the, you heard. Which you just intro. heard right now. Used to be called, officially it was called Bust Box <laughs> Spring. Right. So that was actually the title of the song. Little Bust suggestive, Bust boys. Spring. Little suggestive. Yeah. <laughs> So that that's kind of like the doing. Facebook. <laughs> that's his doing. Just drop the the. He wrote the drop chorus. Bust the. Okay. He wrote the chorus. <laughs> he sent it to me, and then we finished the song. Yeah. And then so we had we you know we were playing that mellower version, and that's what Kelly was asking uh, off mic. It's like, what did it sound like and before? And I and I only heard that version. I don't know a years year, a year. It was a couple years. It was after. a little while. Of, yeah. You'd well, already been playing the heavy version. Yes. You're like, and so what's this? I, we were doing an, an interview or something, and I was like, what the hell am I listening to? Who is it? Because I, I, I thought you recorded without me, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, I was like, when was this, and why wasn't I told about it? Right. I don't know if I can confirm this or not. Like, no, this is like... <laughs> just, that was that was recorded like in 2000... Oh, I was still, I was still at Berkeley. Oh. So 2003. No, uh, well, I I probably just came back from Berkeley. It was probably 2002. Okay, so 2002. Because that was when that was recorded in 2002. <laughs> yeah, yeah I well, understand. It's amazing. <laughs> it was amazing. But but yeah. it's important to know, we were like both listening to Maxwell. A lot. Yes. Oh, that's yeah, that's well, that that's, is, that, is that explains that's why it was like that. <laughs> I was, was like heavy that. into Maxwell. Maxwell was like, oh it. my gosh. Yeah. So so he came up with this oh. thing and that. You know. That's right. So then we played a kind of a mellow version live for a while. And then when we came back to being a three piece after we were a five piece. That's when it more. Then it was like, hey, right. let's like, it was probably D's idea. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure it was. Let's heavy this up, do some heavy guitar, let's see what happens. Yep. And then it became that. Then we recorded that. And then you came into the fold. That sounds about right. And uh, so. Yeah, well, where it is now, though, is, I mean, it's unreal. I mean, the 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 reggae section oh and yeah just, and yeah. but i have to say though i realized during your last show it's like man this is this is the oldest song in the catalog that's being played i think yeah uh, currently it currently it currently, might be right? yeah. Yeah, yeah it probably was uh, around with soccer mom well but, yeah as far as right it is i mean the in terms song, of in terms of well i mean 2002 so there we go yeah but but 2007 um Soccer Mom is on that same album, and Box Spring, but Box Spring oh, is technically okay, right. predated as a song. Correct. So if you want to talk about evolution, Correct. so there it is. Correct. All right. Well, that's your history lesson. So we've week. got we've got people in here to say what's up. Hello. Beth is here. Miko's here. Jen hey. is here from the Philippines. Oh, hi, hon. <laughs> the Dean is here. What's up? All rise. Barry's here. Oh, hi. Good to see Barry. you, Barry. Are you off to Zumba? <laughs> Tuesday night, Zumba night for Barry. He probably is watching. So he's here for Anthony's here. What's up, Anthony? Hey, man. Wow. And uh, hey, how are you, Broncos? Hey, here? Broncos here. And I'm Broncos here. here. Yes. Well, I had to share it. So I'm proud of you. I'm Chip's you. here. Yes. What's up, Chip? This is great. Just making sure. Uh... Deaner's thirty six. That makes you feel better. Yeah. Yeah. Well, okay. three more episodes to go till we catch up to Deaner. I'm the. Oh, we'll. Oh, we'll lap him. Yeah. We'll lap him. <laughs> we'll lap him. We'll lap I'm him confident. Sure. Oh, I'm yeah. confident. With We're. Him. This train's moving. Why not? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Barry. Uh, Berkeley and Boston. That's where... Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, in yeah. Boston. Yeah. Yeah. Berkeley I don't School know if I do that. Yeah. Berkeley College of Music, Boston. Yeah. Oh, check you out. Oh, yeah. He has a... Goodness gracious. He's official. He's got a songwriting degree He's and everything. He's actually yeah. the talented hot take. Most That's right. Don't know that. <laughs> he is. Now, <laughs> I'm an impersonator. Yeah. I'm an imposter. I mean, we, we, we're working with what we got. That. but <laughs> Make and do. Yeah. Make and do. <laughs> So Jimmy's here. What's up, Jimmy? Awesome. 
All right. We got a lot to share with you tonight. I think so. We've got... You haven't seen them yet. I don't want to see them. So you snapped about 1,800 photos. Yeah. So we were live at the coach house Saturday night. Bronco flew in to capture the moment. And man, these photos are awesome. That's what I've heard. Photos are awesome. So we're going to share... Some of these photos with you tonight. Are these all raw photos or have they been edited? No, 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 no. Yeah, I, I wouldn't let them go raw. Okay. So yeah. they're they're pretty dumb. Because ah, I have questionable I, I got, information in I, there. You have... <laughs> <laughs> We've cleaned up all that information. Best I can recall. That's a lot of photos to go wrong. So, Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll get so to we those. Got, we got some photos. I'm sure um, we have. Yeah, we must have show footage because we, we have just show played footage. Saturday night. Yeah, we have good show. show. Yeah, it was a great show. It was fun. It was a lot of fun. Mm-hmm. Um, trying to think of some something that we can. Well, we've got a couple of videos queued up, so we can we'll play those and we'll talk about. We got a lot to cover. We got a lot to cover. Plus, we got a little backstage action. Well, so why not start oh, with some backstage yeah. action? I know what's happening from the coach house. <laughs> mm-hmm. This is in the green room, which is really uh, AKA the graffiti room. I don't remember what happened. Which you will see right now. <laughs> Let me find the king. All right. My my own my oh, chicken. Oh, you remember uh, Brian, back, right? my drummer? Yes. Um. So he came out to the Philippines to. He met a girl. We introduced him to a girl, and she's actually here now. And. Uh, Hi. <laughs> hey. <laughs> and um, he came out to visit uh, to meet her, but he was it, it was so funny because What's up, the Rob? things that I started getting like. Used Burners, to, man. There it is. See, this is a good gig to be at because this stuff is like. You can't find it anywhere. Find it anywhere. Yeah, I, was like, I was cleaning the front yard the other day and I found a can of this soda called Bubble well, Up. Do you remember that stuff? No. Dude, my parents drank that in the 70s. Yeah. Bubble Up. I bubble Up, it. yeah. I remember uh, Knee High. Do you remember Knee High? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I, never, I didn't know Bubble Up. Yeah, and then there was a Coke can. It was one of those. Remember they were like flat on top? Yeah. Where, yeah, I found those in there. I was cleaning up the front yard doing that, you know, getting rid of the ivy and everything. This is so cool. There is something. Uh, that come on <laughs> come on that is so good that was rob that's barry's friend rob who's super nice yes great guy and um uh, rob had my back that night so thank you rob thank you, yeah rob. yes so verners i didn't even know what verners was do you know verners <laughs> yeah that's a thing. Yeah, I do. It's not a thing. It must be a thing in California know. because we don't know about that. In oh, Virginia. you don't get that on the East Coast, no. do you? No. So he was like, Verner's is so great. I'm like, never heard of it. It's a shame. Don't know what well, that is. Well, for every White Castle you guys have, there's a Verner's. There's here. a Verner's. Well, we don't even have White Castle. Really? Jersey has White Castle, right? Yeah, I think it's more Midwestern, isn't it? Mm, so maybe. Maybe. So Ohio. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. They might have it in New York as well. Well, they probably do. Yeah, yeah. So. Well, but York's it wasn't. It yeah. wasn't a, a Virginia, Maryland, no. DC. They thing. never made it there. Oh, White that's Castle. So now, if I mean even now. No, no. Okay. No. So Verners. Strong stance with Five Guys out there is my guess. Then I don't know. Oh, I don't yeah, know yeah, what. Yeah, it, five yeah, it's a Five Guys city out there. Well, yeah. I mean, uh, we don't have In and Out. So, I know. So Five Guys oh, kind right. of filled that void. Right. Well, you so, don't even feel that void, do you? Well, I don't really eat there. Well, but, yeah. Why would you? I mean. <laughs> It's a heart attack and a bun. Oh, 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 the lines have been drawn. Wonderful. Thank you. And thank you to our sponsors. Yes. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, exactly. But the views expressed on this program yeah. are solely those of no. It's fine. Yeah. yeah, that's good. We're covered. We're that's covered. That's right. That's fair. That's fair. That's uh, right. No, he was very helpful that night, and, and, and it was it was good to have him there. Yeah. Awesome. Yes. So thank you, Rob. You got to you got to meet Rob you officially, just, unofficially. Just wandering around with that camera, and yeah. you're picking up as much footage. As I'm possible. just getting some. You know, you never know. What's I was having happen. a nice conversation with his brother, and he's just filming me there. I'm like, yeah, chill, I'm like, chill out, Michael Moore. This doesn't have to be a thing. Come <laughs> on, bro. See, Beth never heard of Verner's either. She grew up in Southern California. Hmm. So that's a thing that. That sounds like a San Pedro problem. Maybe it's well, maybe. And we maybe. can talk. We, you and I can talk yeah. about that later. Yeah, yeah. Barry confirms White Castle in New York City. There you go. See. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, bunch of crazies. All right. So, um, Bronco came out, and if you don't know, I mean, we we did mention that he went to Berkeley School of Music. Fantastic musician. He's got a band called Sandbox Kings, which I'm not sure if that's uh, still. It, no, I mean it's uh, Brian uh, Mulroney. Hey, right. Brian, if you're watching, um, he and I play 
kind of duo acoustic gigs from time to time. So, okay. uh, and having said that, if you're in the DC area, more specifically Middleburg, Virginia, on the 26th of this month, we are playing. So, we're going to play some Sandbox Kings material, uh, but we have a special guest all the way from the Philippines. Uh, and she's quite the celebrity over there. Her name's Jem Ramos. And she's an amazing singer, amazing dancer. She had kind of like uh, her version of, uh, uh, I don't know if you would classify it as like Spice Girls or kind of okay. like a dancing, like five piece, like dancing group. Okay. And man, she is one amazing performer. She's awesome. great. So she's going to guest uh, perform with us on a few songs. So it's going to be a real treat. Nice. So All strong right. plug. Yeah. yeah. National plug. So Love Red it. Horse Tavern, October 26th. Thank you. 9 p.m. All right. Middleburg. There. there you go. Middleburg, you Virginia. Go. Be there. So let's talk about photography. And, um, you know, when I remember it when you were 11 or 12. Mm -hmm. So Bronk was taking shots with i think you had like a disposable camera <laughs> and yeah. you ended up entering into a photo contest yeah these shots that you took in um you went to turkey or you went to what were uh, those well maybe that was i, I entered no, well i entered two years okay so i i went to spain on an exchange program that's right and yes, it was a disposable camera. It was a disposable camera. And this guy, wait, this guy wins. Wait. <laughs> hold, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We're, we're burying the lead here a second. Okay. What, what's, uh, if, if you don't mind me, like, what is what is your background with, with photography? Like, where does this come from? Uh, well, our mom is quite the photographer. Okay. So we grew up with her in the dark room. So, oh, okay. So she, you know, one of my er earliest memories as a child was being in the dark room with her as she was developing prints. Right. She, you know, she put on jazz and you've got, you know, the red light going. I mean, it's such an awesome memory. Right. It's so cool. And you're sitting there, so you got the glow of the projector. The only thing you're missing is chain smoking at this point. Chain <laughs> this, is, this is well, like, yeah, this is like a William S. Yeah, Burroughs sort in, of situation. Inhaling chemicals, right? I mean, why not? It's, 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 it's there. But, uh, you know, but I, I think that's what, you know, brought it on because my mom, I remember her having... A couple of cameras like around her all the time okay yeah so she, she had like a black and white film camera and then right. a color oh well, she so, did because you literally had to have two separate ones yeah i remember her doing that i don't know how often she did that but um she would take you know slide images and then okay. you know but she would always have it and she was always you know into photography she hung photos up on all our walls and uh, she entered competitions so that's why i wanted to do it okay so she entered the same competition well, it was in our little town. Okay. And and she's like, hey, you know, they've got... I don't know what was the catalyst for entering the competition. But I, I I don't know. As soon as I have a camera, I have an urge to, like, go for a shot. I got to find a shot. E even, even back then, I mean, you know, people were like, what are you doing? It's like, why don't you, you know, like, enjoy the moment? Right. But I, I, I don't know. I, I can't do that. I have that. to capture it. I can't do that. It's fun for me hunting for that stuff. Right. I realize it now. At the time, I didn't realize what I was doing. Right. But I was just like, wow, that looks really cool. And then just click. But it, it was a Kodak, like, you know, yellow paper. Right. It's just, it's actually like a, it's just a, a, a film. Kids, like, back in the day, we didn't have yeah. cell phones. <laughs> right. Yeah. And so you had to actually purchase a camera. If you didn't have a professional grade camera, <laughs> there was this thing in the 80s and 90s called a disposable camera. Yeah. <laughs> and what you would do is when you went on vacation to Disneyland or family vacation, you would have to buy a camera right, and take right. photos. And you'd have to scroll it. You have to keep scrolling it until you did 30. Oh, that's right. You oh, yeah. Find yeah, it. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Oh, yeah, baby. That was the best part. Yeah. And then you'd have to go to a store and get the pictures. Yes. To tell. It's a whole thing. Yeah. Ask your grandparents about it. It's amazing. <laughs> yeah. Or your dad. Maybe. I, you know, I'm, yeah. I'm not Maybe. a grandparent yet, so. Well, yeah. you know, but, give credit. <laughs> but yeah, so I came back and my mom, I think, probably suggested, why don't you enter, you know, I had some shots that were kind of like landscape shots, some architectural shots, and I entered like three categories and I, you know, I... <laughs> I think I swept one of them. Come got, on. Yeah, I think I got yeah. first, second, and third With place. With the disposable yeah. camera. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. So you entered your first competition with yeah, cam well, with pictures from a disposable camera? Yes. Yeah, And yeah, you yeah. got first, second, and third place? I, I entered five photos, and I got first, second, third, first, and second. I well, think. that's just showing off at yeah. that point. 
Well, it was a student category, so okay. it's not like I, you know, was in a pool of thousands. You okay. Know. Yeah. You know, but it was. Still. But yeah, I mean, hey, still. that instills confidence, right? Yeah. <laughs> Way to stick it to Kyle, who got stuck with six. Come on, bro, go give me a chance, bro. <laughs> I didn't enter every category. <laughs> yeah, you were nice. Oh my oh, goodness, I, you were nice. I thought I could do well on. So. Wow. But uh, so anyway, so it was there from an early age, and then I, I didn't really keep up with it because it was just like kind of like a thing that i would do on vacation just like a hobby at that point right i took i took one semester in high school of photography loved it again but i was already at that point doing music and okay. music i don't know and in, in my brain it was just like well you're the musician not the photographer hmm. so but every time i had a camera it's like i was i was like man this is i, I want to like i want to go for something i don't want to just take a snapshot mm -hmm. so did music and you know, even at Berkeley, I ran around with a little disposable a couple of times. And okay. Went around. I got to find those. I ran, ran around Boston because Boston's got some amazing, oh, yeah. like, architecture. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, that's probably what I was doing, just running around the streets and uh, taking photos. So, I mean, uh, did music, you know, had tons of kids. <laughs> hey, kids, if you're watching. <laughs> and, um, you know, last year, I... I wanted to do photography. Actually, I wanted to do video. Okay. I wasn't even thinking about doing photography. I wanted to do video. I wanted to actually do some YouTube videos for promoting my business or whatnot. And I, I bought a camera specifically for video. It's a great camera. but Is this the first professional camera you've ever owned at this point? Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted to track with that. I, I've yeah. never owned a camera. Disposable seems to no, be No, no, no. I'm thing. sorry. I'm, no, I, I did own a, a decent camera, but it was purely for... I was a construction contractor at the okay. time. So it was purely for doing portfolio shots. Got it. Okay. So it, I, and I, so the bug would came back slightly, but I was so busy. It was in work. Kids, <clears throat> work, no time for that. Totally. So, so I, I got this camera with the intent of doing video and I'm, I start taking a few stills. I'm like, man, this is so gratifying. It's so instant. I was like, man. So for six months, I didn't do a single video. So, and I was like, man, I love still photography. I, and, and it was just like, wow. I, and then a point came in our lives where, boy, that's getting into, I'll, I'll give the abbreviated version, but my family moved to the Philippines, big lifestyle change. And I realized, wow, I can do photography as a living. And so I was like, yeah, this is fun. I mean, I get to express my creativity through it in a totally different way. I mean, I view it like songwriting. I mean, it's it's really, mm. uh, it's amazing in that sense. And I got burned out on music big time. And with the kids, uh, you know, there was no time for it. So I was always kind of like, um, if I don't have time for it, I don't even want to attempt it. Okay. Because I can't delve into it. Right. Um, but doing photography has got me back into music because editing photos, you're at the computer, you're listening to songs. Right. And uh, it's amazing how the two work together. Hmm. So, so let's show some photos from Saturday night. And we've got um, a few different sets to go through, but we're going to start here. So, I know you were moving around a lot, so now you're side stage, and and the shots are in no particular order. So, uh, yeah, look at that. That's good. Wow. Rocking out. Yeah. Oh man, I never even saw you on that side. <laughs> over over on oh, my side. Oh no, I I saw him like halfway through the set and I was like, Oh yeah, I forgot. Yeah. He's here. Well you were in your element. I, I apparently I was. Oh yeah. I saw it. Man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, look at that. It's I love good. that one. It's really good. Yeah. Yeah, this is all just fresh information rolling in right now. Mm-hmm. So, uh, okay, so, so the girl in that's kind of in the center, that was really funny. The, so we do boom our first song guitar solo. I come there's like all of a sudden there's a new set of stairs right at the center of I the stage. Never, it was never there before. At least yeah. I don't remember. So it was perfect. So I. I Went down the steps, sat down and playing the solo, and I'm like basically playing it to her. And I don't. Beth caught some shots 
of that. Oh of yeah, that she moment. had a good vantage for that. She had I a bet. good vantage point. And it was so funny because she was smiling big and like is this, oh. you know, we just had a little moment. And the look on her boyfriend's face, <laughs> I was not so happy. I, I, I saw him, and I and was then, like, and then, and uh, then, in the shot, this. in the one shot, you see, it's like she's looking at me. We're having a moment. <gasps> boyfriend's not so thrilled, and a dude two tables over is laughing at the situation. Uh, it's so great. Oh man, that is fantastic. So uh, we got to see that. I'll, I'll show. Yeah, I will grab that <laughs> photo for next week. Beth, Beth caught that. So, that's awesome. So hilarious. Uh, that's a story. Yeah, telling a story. Totally. Totally. Okay, we're going to do uh, another set here. Yeah, man. That's a lot of people. A lot of people. Good stuff. Is, yeah, it's a good crowd. It's fun. There he is. Yeah. Barry. <laughs> Boy, it's fun watching him play. So much focus. Oh, man. And I love because he's he's always thinking about you know symbol placement, yeah, and where where exactly he wants to put them if he wants them you know at this level or at that level so he can. Well, I think he knew know. I was coming because he really did me a favor by having them up. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if he had them lower, I, I I'd be seeing symbols all the time. I wouldn't have a shot at you. You wouldn't be seeing him. Yeah, yeah so that kind of worked out naturally. Yeah. So did you? Yeah. Okay. I see what happened. That's great, though. Wow. I didn't even get a chance to look at that one. Um, you sent. Them, I was like, you pick them, because I didn't want. It was, you know, no, yeah. there's too many. I'm like, yeah. you pick them. You send them. Was, I'll load them in, and then we'll. Yeah. It, it was. Know. It was hard. I mean, there's there's so many great moments of you guys. Nice. Yeah, I, I like that one. Barry. That's really good. Barry, not sure if you're still here, but these are some cool shots. Yeah. Serious focus. Nice. Wow. All right, we got more to show, but I wanted to start with that. Wow. And um, <clears throat> yeah, man. Yeah. It's Really great. It's fun. Really great. Frenzied though. It was so fast. <laughs> oh my god. Forty five minutes never flew by so quickly, right? <laughs> and that that's that place is not easy to, to get around. Because yeah, you've got, got all, all those tables. All those crowded. tables. Those picnic tables yeah. are they're just kind of wedged. And there's not a lot of room. And wait to walk staff in running back and forth. Right. And yeah. I must have been bumped, I don't know, four or five times. Yeah. And you know, I just I, Unless somebody did it to me again or like tapped me, because I wasn't sure if somebody was trying to get my attention, right, or just get by you. So if it happened twice, then I would look up, but I, I never looked up. I was just trying to you maneuver. Know. Right. And you guys, you know, you're so fluid that oh, it was frustrating. And there were a couple points where I, I think there was one point. We're never where, in the same shot together. Well, you ran <laughs> over. To, you ran over to him just as I got over to your side. Oh yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Damn it, Kelly! Don't yeah, you know I'm here? That's me. I don't know what's going on. I have no idea. The going? glasses come off. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I'm just trying to finish the set at this point. So I have like a sequence of shots, but they're all like I can't see your faces at all. It's just me running away. You two, well, I don't no, know you two, you two are singing. I think you're sharing the mic together. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. And I was like, oh, why couldn't I have been oh, on the other God. side? <laughs> I know. We don't play in those things. I know. Hey, some that. some more people have joined us. Want to say hi to Ray? Yeah. Hi to Alexa. Mom and dad are here. Hey, mom. Your hey, two dad. Sons are on uh, yeah. the live stream tonight, so glad you could be here. And Ellen's here. All right. Let me see what's happening in here. Uh, so Chip says. Chip that, is praising your mom's photos. Yeah, she she has she, yeah she has some amazing photos, and she would. Were some of those hang up at the house? Yeah. Yes. I'm trying to remember, I think all I of them. Them. All of them were hers. Yeah, yeah. I think I. Saw and she them. also yeah. had submitted a bunch and won. Oh yeah, she of, she won. I mean. Yeah. I mean, the entire corridors were had ribbons. Yes, you know. I recall that now. So, yes, yeah. She she yeah. definitely uh, great, I mean, she great photographer, and that's I mean that's you know handed down. So yeah. thanks, know. mom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. So let's do. Uh, we're gonna play a video from the show at the coach house, and you'll probably see Bronco running around, <laughs> getting shots. Probably. Yeah. Yep. So this is uh, Sugar Daddy, Sugar Mama. What's up, what's up? 
shoe's gonna fall off. I can feel it already. It's not gonna be good. Just make sure to leave it by the gear over there so I can take it home. This song's called Sugar Daddy, Sugar Mama. commenting on uh, there was a jump that Kelly did and he was like ah, see I missed it I don't know <laughs> that's what I'm talking about I can't control right. that that's what I'm talking about uh, you're not supposed to no you're not supposed that. to I, don't know I got a lot of other great moments of you <laughs> <laughs> just not that one yeah. but that's all right I'll shoot a few more shows I'll get it yeah, be, yeah, yeah, you'll, yeah. you'll find it you'll I'll find it. it in the pocket I'll there somewhere it. yeah absolutely <laughs> absolutely so um, also if you notice the the video was um, just a little bit shaky what what had happened is we had the the phone the iphone on a tripod but the frequency the low end of the bass and the kick drum were vibrating the whole uh too much awesomeness yeah it was was vibrating the space and it was just saying uh, we make no apologies that's what we're saying so deal you know just move Technology with it. can't really hang with you guys. Hey, like that. Could, I, yeah. I would just subtly shake with it, and then yeah. I think it'll feel normal. Maybe the iPhone 12 <laughs> will be able to handle it. Yeah. I don't know. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, that's good. Um, 
I want to switch gears and so here's a song that we've played before but only like we I don't know that we've ever whatever it's a it's a silly silly <laughs> thing that came up and at the, when we wrote it at the time it was during one of those all night gigs and you know they always call out for last call last call last call so we were like oh, oh we should do a last call song and it, it has nothing to do with the rest of our catalog <laughs> it's just kind of this country thing this and, is something that i've never officially been introduced to so the fact so that i'm about to hear about, something yeah, yeah. you haven't heard this not that no, not i haven't recording. heard this why would i no he oh. never heard the recording so this is great this would always come up whenever we'd have that's right. I mean, I, okay, but the timeline is so vast that it you is. Know, yeah. I'm trying to place where you're in that. Uh, no, th whenever we would have a three hour set and we would just joke about like, oh, we need songs to fill the set, and they would be like, well, we could. I don't even know what it's called. It's called Last Call. We could just we could do Last Call, and then you two we would, just you would laugh, it. and I'm like, yeah. oh, okay, I guess we're <laughs> okay. doing it. I guess that's what's so happening. So he's played it. I don't know. He's never heard it before. There's yeah, no way yeah. I played it. Now, more than what's three times. what's so great about this is Bronco plays Slide. No, I played lap steel. La lap steel. Oh, he's got. Okay. He's yeah. got a. He had a. Do you still have it? Yeah, I still have okay. it. Okay, yeah. he's got a lap steel, and so we recorded the song. D and I recorded it here, and then we were telling you about it. Yeah. And he was like, "Oh, send it to me, and I'll record lap steel on it." So you're gonna hear Bronco playing lap steel. This is all new. On last call. <laughs> this is all new. And I don't even know who this band is. At this point. And <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so. Our dog before Jazz, mm -hmm. Matisse. You didn't meet Matisse. I... You came right after Matisse passed uh, away. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. So, so Matisse was the original studio dog. Yeah. She was always in the studio with me. So you'll hear Matisse on the last <laughs> call recording. And it legitimately happened. It's so great. This and I kept it on bullshit. there. This <laughs> is Well, this is a deep this is a hidden track. He would This is yes, it's on it's on the Color of Music album. <laughs> but it you have to let track ten play for another two minutes. Kids, and back then, in the day there were CDs, yeah, right. and they that was they, a thing. There used to be this thing called hidden tracks, yeah. and digital age ruined that for you. There'll <laughs> never be another hidden track again. Yeah, nobody has patience for that. No, no. 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 So we're, why are there twenty three tracks of silence on this? Yeah, I don't get. Although it. So, I would say movies have replaced that. You know, you wait for the credits. This to roll, is true, and you get that little that, last bit. No that, more hidden that, tracks. That, you yeah. just have yeah. Marvel yeah. Avengers behind Easter the scenes. Yep. Yeah, yeah, right. All right, All right so, just uh, I'm ready. I'm ready for I, this? this. is as ready as I'm ever gonna be. All right, so we're gonna do it. This is weird. It's uh, <laughs> this is officially weird. So it is. <laughs> it's also a um, lyric video, so you can sing along. There's oh. a lyric video yeah. for this. What? Last call. <laughs>
There it is. That was a lot to uh, digest right. right there. All right. All right. Look. Look. <laughs> and, I, and I say this with love. I say this with love. But if that doesn't scream, like, first semester of college, my first, like, <laughs> iMovie project. Oh, yeah. I don't, I, don't, I don't know what Oh, does. well, come on. I don't know what does. Come on. Absolutely. That, there is no... Okay. There is no way that I played that song in its entirety. That that I guarantee you that when we played it, it you, was just the one time. You definitely laughed your way through it. Yeah, <laughs> I yeah. guarantee yeah, it. Yeah, 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 for sure. Because that is all new information to me. Yeah. But that lap steel part. Wow, great part. Oh yeah, I had fun with that. That was great part. That was loads of fun. Yeah, we had fun recording it. I mean, uh, you know, D was doing the low. If you ain't got <laughs> nobody. <laughs> it's great so much fun uh, last call oh wow yeah fun stuff how about that you learned something i mean that was a lot of new stuff for you i've been take i've i've taken in a lot of information in only 41 minutes <laughs> yes so you're gonna be all right this feels like a college class that i wasn't prepared for like right. hey i'm behind on this class so there can we will be a quiz tomorrow that's yeah. terrible uh, that's terrible be prepared wow be prepared brian sierra is here iris is here Welcome. Welcome to the show. Glad you're here. We're just going through some old footage and uh, also some new pics that my brother Bronco took of the show at the coach house. So we do have some more um, pics to show. Um, I'm going to, we're going to plug some of your other photography really quick. Okay. So, great. Because um, he does good work. He Amazing work. Right. So if you are in need of a photographer, Bronco's I'm he's available. A world traveler. He's all yeah. over. So, uh, ah, uh, Larry. I don't know if he's he's probably asleep right now, but I love this shot of Larry. Should I have a business? This, he's this is my business card. Uh, but Larry, who plays for Spoiler Alert, which is a Southern Maryland rock band, uh, this is him. He's usually the bass player, but on this particular song, he's he's singing lead, and uh, yeah, great stuff. The beard and. The lights. I love this one. Wow. Yeah. Where was this shot? Uh, it's just a. It's a bar in Southern Maryland. Okay. Um, they got their own, you know, light set up and. Nice. Yeah. Ah, so, this one um, was uh, exhibited. Shoot, I can't remember where this one was. It's on the website. <laughs> but this one was exhibited somewhere in Europe. I can't remember. Uh, like in a pop-up gallery. So. Wow, that's um, a great shot. Yeah, that one, uh, I like that one. That was nice. Uh, my daughter, Roxy. This was in the Philippines at uh, kind of like a fun museum where they've got like, you know, I, I don't know, something to do with like paper shreds or whatever. So my uh, kid, okay. my I picture kids, like the thing, you know, that you pop, you know, the confetti. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, like this was like something everywhere. to do with like shredders and stuff like that. So they have this big pile of like shredded paper. Right. And you can shred paper in this like machine. And so my kids were going nuts, and I mean, just click away. Yeah, that's a good shot. Ah, yeah, this was uh, L.A. Yep, L.A. Oh yeah, we were together. Yeah, we. It was a rainy night, and we went down uh, downtown L.A. Yeah, and Walt Disney. Yeah, so that one also was exhibited too in architectural oh, cool. category. Yeah. Wow. It's a great shot. Okay, so this one, uh, I I went uh, on a, a crab boat on the Chesapeake Bay for two days, just kind of following these guys do their thing. That's nuts. And, uh, man, that was amazing. I, I'm not done with that project. That project, I've got some plans for that. I got, a, I got a lot of details to kind of figure out. But that was a very amazing, just, that project hit me. It's a deep project. These guys are unbelievable. Hmm unbelievable their story is so amazing and their job is so tough it's like all the stuff you see on uh what is it what's the show on discovery you know like the like wildest catch or something like yeah, that. Yeah, 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 yeah 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 these guys were telling me it's just like man it's like people think that's what it's like and it's not like that at all it's wow. just repetition after repetition after repetition of just these sets of just pulling up pots it's just, it's like an assembly line Right, and you just got to keep going, and it's amazing because it's such a beautiful environment. But these guys are so focused; they're, you know, they don't think about that. They're out there every day. Yeah, they just want to 
do their work, get back, and it's just like, wow. It's just it's an amazing experience. I, I want to do something really special with that. So I've got a lot of photos from that. So that was just one. Wow. That was crazy. Very cool. All right. So since um, we've got kind of box spring on the on the brain from the intro, we played the <laughs> demo of box spring. We're going to play box spring from the Coach House show. Why not? Nice. From Saturday night. So here we are with the reggae breakdown. <laughs>
so Facebook's doing a weird thing. Not sure uh, if you're still following along. So if you would, shoot a comment. Shoot a comment in the box there and um, let me know you're still here. Because I got a, a pop-up that said um, there might be a copyright infringement. We stole our own music. Yet we own everything. <laughs> <laughs> we own everything that we've streamed here. So... You can't assume Facebook knows that. Come on. They actually, some of the earlier, like I can't, the reason I never play like the things that are already released uh -huh. that are on iTunes or, you know, Google Play or whatever, it'll, you'll be able to live stream it and you'll see it that one time and then the replays, we'll they, just, they just take it down. Yeah. So I contested it and argued like, yeah, they're, they, and they said, well, the note I got back was, you need to contact the record label and talk to them. Yeah, I am the record label. Yeah. Well, I need, just talked to the record label and they said it's fine. We need an official letter from the record label they didn't, they didn't saying care. that it's okay. And they didn't care. So Shocking. Yeah. Shocking. So uh, I'm not seeing anybody commenting. Interesting. So if that's the case, they'll be able to watch it after the fact. I don't know. We'll keep going. We've got eight minutes. Yeah. We're good. It was a full show. Yeah. So we got a few more picks to show because you will be able to catch this on the replay. Why not? If you're not still with us now. So uh, here we go. So much anger. Primal. So much anger. It's good. Where does it all come you, from? Yeah, but you do this Where thing. Where does it all go? You do this thing. I love it, though. <laughs> you, you know... I, this, a song's playing, being played. I can't remember what song. I mean, it happened several times. But Arif's singing, and you're just jamming out, and you're off the mic, and you just let out this like <laughs> primal scream. <laughs> but it's awesome because it's very quiet because it's not mic'd. Right. But you can hear it, and I'm telling you, it adds so much. Right. Like it, it really like it's so effective. Like it, it gets you going. I'm just like, oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> so I just like to yell. It's awesome, man. So, it it adds so much. It's so like great. Yelling. Nice shot. That's a good shot. Wow, man. Good color too. You're yeah. not screaming there. You see? see? Yeah, look now at he's you. such a nice boy. Look at you. He seems so nice when yeah. he's not moving. <laughs> <laughs> Which is rare. That is rare. The rare moment. It's rare. <laughs> my jazz shot yeah <laughs> get more jazz gigs from yeah. that one <laughs> there we go oh, okay. that's the problem there we go. Yeah. that's the problem primal ah, kelly comes through it's concerning there it's like it oh, oh that what jazz was, gig just went away what <laughs> was i going through at that moment wow it's great well, it could have been, you, you know, your toe was actually feeling the floor. As argue well, that is definitely true. <laughs> we, we, we personally discussed that in length, all yeah. of us in here. So yeah. uh, that is concerning. Okay. That's great. All right. And there's uh, another set here. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Little master of ceremonies there. <laughs> Hey. hey! All right. Yeah, pre-show Barry. Prep. Well, he has pre-show yeah. nap in. Power nap. That's it. I respect that. He had a, he had a lot to do. I'm so. not smart enough to do that. <laughs> I should start doing that more often. He was like, "Yep, yeah. that's good." We have a few minutes. Yep. Okay. Good. Good. Gonna, <laughs> Power gonna, nap. Uh, let me know when we're ready. Okay. No problem. Yeah. Yeah. Throwing it down. So nice. He's a nice boy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's extremes with me. That's that's the unfortunate. That's good. Yeah. Yeah. There's a lot going. On. Uh, this is this is best as yet to come. Uh, it totally is. Yep. Yeah. yeah. I like that one. Cause you're both kind of just letting loose. Mm -hmm. Barry's reading the paper. I'm not sure. What's going on. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. I'm <laughs> Wow. Nicely done. Fun stuff. Fun shots, Bronco. Nice Nicely stuff. Done. Goodness gracious. Yeah. Really cool. It was fun. Too fast. I Those wish... are tough pictures to live up to. 
Well, I, I have to live up to that entertainment level. <laughs> now people are gonna see those shots and be like, "Well, know. he was off tonight." He yeah, I mean, I'm used. To, I'm expecting. Where's that? It's terrible. Where's that know. moment? Yeah. We've I seen the moment captured, so get, I want to see it live. I, I gonna, only captured what happens on a regular basis. Well, I'm gonna get more flack for this than you realize. <laughs> I appreciate you putting in the work and effort to do. Well, that. hey, you know, if I help you get better, it's gonna take these shots I, and I, just disappear to the Philippines. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. I'll come back to check on you. It's like every sure. other foreign girlfriend I've ever had. It's terrible. <laughs> oh man. Oh, so good. It was fun though. I mean, it was great watching you guys. Thank you. I mean, I have to say, yeah. you know, your level of musicianship is just so awesome. I mean, your arrangements. You know, you're doing the trio thing so well. So well. You guys have this great... I mean, you let it breathe, but you fill it in. You've got all these great sections. You, you never get, you know, bored or dull with anything. That's you know? the thing. We're not boring. That's what yeah. I tell no. That's literally what I tell people. I was like, no. how's your band? We're not boring. And, and, <laughs> That's and, it. That's all you need to know. And we, were, and we were talking about it. You know, I mentioned it, is that I feel like, you know, maybe as, you know, somebody who knows music, I feel like you guys have this subtle mastery that probably goes over some people's heads you know i mean i really appreciate the way you guys do your arrangements and all that stuff and it's just i don't know from a music musician's perspective it's so fun to watch you guys that would explain some of the reactions we've gotten on tour <laughs> it would yeah in a subtly brilliant way <laughs> oh yeah sometimes kelly has to prompt the audience uh it's okay to clap now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the song is over. The song is over. It's yeah. okay. You can... It's okay. You can react. And that happened after Soccer Mom. Oh, yeah. I mean, Soccer Mom. Oh, boy. Like, <laughs> it, it was like Jaws were on the floor. and like, what is this? I don't know what this is. People but, scare okay. easily. Yeah, I guess. They do. And they're like, oh, oh, this is fun. We're allowed to have fun. Oh, yeah, okay, we get it now. Yeah, pretty much. It's good. Yeah, I can see how you guys surprise people. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we got some comments um, from Saturday night. Um, some of the people that had, you know, never seen us before, and they saw there was an opening band. They didn't realize there was one. They were coming to see the Dan Band, and they're like, "What is this?" And I thought, "Oh no, opening band, right?" <laughs> <sighs> okay, but they're wow, totally surprised and blown away, and that was fantastic. Well, you know, it was funny, you know, uh, the, the the main guy for the Dan band, Dan. I yeah, guess. Dan. He, uh, you know, he's he's a comedian, so he's ripping into everybody, but he didn't rip into you guys. Yeah. He he used I mean, us he uh, in, yeah. his, in his, uh, you know, in his improv, but it was always... It was I, you guys were up here. It yeah, it was nice. all about, you know... Yeah. Uh, we go way back with Dan. Yeah. <laughs> we did play with Dan a couple of years We ago. have an understanding. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's just say that. <laughs> well, there was some questionable use of oleo props, but you know. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah that's right. <laughs> we gave him license the to party do that. He knows. Too. He knows the arrangement we have with him. That's right. Don't say a word, Dan. Yeah, you know, right. I will. I'll take your ass to court. I'm not afraid. Uh, I'm not afraid. Yeah, I'll do it. Mm. All right. Well, I think this brings our episode to a close. I'm not sure if you're still watching live or not. There's no way for us to see that because I think Facebook has come in and done such a wonderful job policing us. <laughs> yes, so we're so controversial. Too much awesomeness. He's so upset. We're so awesome. controversial. <laughs> so we are going. We'll be banned in America at this point. We'll only be able to air in the Philippines, arguably, at this point. So. <laughs> Maybe so. Who knows? So. so next week is inside the OMG episode 34, and uh, man. Thank you so much for yeah. being here. This was My so pleasure. cool. Also, that, so much fun. Man. Usually you're on the other side. Yeah. Well, 3,000 yeah. miles away I'm, or you're... Right. Yeah. yeah having 12. coffee. Yeah. <laughs> the next day. Tomorrow. Yeah. That's, that's, tomorrow. that's a trip. You're now you're tired ahead. like us. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I am right now. I'm still, <laughs> I'm still halfway between East Coast time and that's here. That's right. Yeah. But yeah. It's fun being inside, inside the OMG. Inside. Yeah. yeah, this was cool. Cool Thanks, moment. Guys. Yeah, cool moment. Appreciate Absolutely. it. Thanks for coming, man. Yeah. Thanks for being Thank here. You. Thanks for all those great shots. Well, so, so I'd awesome. love to do it again. Yep. yep, yep. And we have there's a huge volume 
of shots that we'll be sharing over the next few weeks because I mean, few weeks, any, <laughs> few all weeks. night, <laughs> few weeks. all night. That's strong. That's strong. <laughs> and you should check out Bronco's website. Oh yes, thank if you. Not, thank you, Kelly. The Hodzik Photo. Check it out. Dot com. Yep. Right. So Blow the letter B, Hodzik H O D Z I C, Photo. Dot com. Blow him up. Yep. Hit him up. Give him Hire a him. bump. Yep. He'll take your shots. He's amazing, as He'll you've seen. It. He'll do it. He's the real deal. <laughs> the real deal. Just, he'll do it. All right. Episode 33. Come to a close. We'll see you next time. Next week, next Tuesday, as always. Episode 34. Have a great week. Take care. Be well. Ciao. to no good you know the ones you know the ones that work real hard like the good one should you know the ones you know the ones somewhere between night and midnight howling at the moon dancing in the moonlight for everything got crazy up in here you better stop sweet nothing's in my ear meet me meet me meet me it's 12 we can get we can get dirty Number one, somewhere between nine and midnight, howling at the moon, dancing in the moonlight. Everything got crazy up in here. You better stop, sweet nothing's in my ear. Meet me, meet me, meet me at twelve thirty. We can get, we can get dirty. Oh, we can get dirty. Oh, getting real dirty. Oh, we can get dirty. So we can get dirty Did you think, did you think I wanna get dirty? Oh, oh, with a wink and a drink You wanna get dirty Oh, oh, we should stop right now Before we get started We get started, we get started Somewhere between nine and midnight Howling at the moon, dancing in the moonlight Everything got crazy up in here You better stop, sweet nothing's in my ear Meet me, meet me, meet me It's 12.30